Hi everyone, welcome back to another video of Ace Code. In this video, we will learn how to create a, this type of blogging post for this movie blogging post. If you have movie website, the movie blogging post, how we can design this type of very beautiful movie blogging post website. This card design is like this. Now you can see. So let's get started this video here. Here you can see I have added basic HTML file and this title, and I have added a style file. And now after this body section here, I will add a class name that is card, and inside this card class name. So we'll add some elements. So first of all, we will make it step by step. So let's copy this body class, and here I will type this style file, and style is display flex and justify content center, align item center, and min height is 100 VAs. So just like this, we can set this, and we can set also the background, but we are not going to set because background we're going to make it the by default white. So now we'll select that this card, and we'll enter this. Now we'll set this width and height. So it is 900 pixel and height is we'll go to make it this 450 pixel and now we'll type this for border. So here I'm going to choose this for each of the border is different type of colors. So here I'm choosing this border bottom 5 pixel and solid that is color code and this border top 5 pixel solid that is color code is green and here this border left that is yellow color and this border right is that's here so I'm going to add a blue color. So that's it you can see now it's this border is looking like this and it's good. So now we'll go for this card class and here we'll add a background image. So I am typing this background image here and here we will type this URL. So this image link you will find in my description. You can check there and now you can see that image is showing here. And we want to make some exact size so that's why we are setting this background size is cover. So it will be size this pixels with this skin size as usual. So after adding this now go to this card class and this section will add type this. That is here I am adding this another class is content box. So this is content class and in this time here I will add this h1 that is for title. So here for sorry h2 that is for title and this inside this I will add a break line. So this will be text will be go to this two line of text here. Now copy this h tag here and now we will paste this this p tag. For this p tag here I will adding this a description for movie I can see like this. So now let's go to this and here this continent copy this content class and enter here and now we'll type this background so first of all we'll set this background color so here i'm going to choose that a massable color so just go to this image frame and use the developer tools here i'm selecting any colors and here i'm choosing this matching color like this by just hovering your developer tools here so let's choose this color is looking like this now copy this color code here just copy it and enter here this color code you can see like this and now we'll set this weight for this item here i'm going to set this 450 pixel and height also the same that is 450 pixel and here we'll set this top left and the bottom is zero so that this all item will be go to this as the center is like this and this section now we have to add this overflow hidden for this card item because this element something is going to outside so we set this water item and this now we'll go to for this to this color here so now we can make it some of this decrease opacity here we'll decrease some opacity more and this background opacity now we can see this background image also floating inside this so after adding this so now we'll go for this s2 tag and enter this s2 tag and now we'll open this style file here i will type this color for this white color and now here i'm going to add a padding that is 20 pixel and 10 pixel and here i will set this font size that is 3 rem and now we'll set this for this text transform it will be this this all text will be uppercase so it means the capital and this letter is facing 0.5 pixel now it's going some very more so now we'll decrease this font size now you can see like this now we'll make some padding this for this and now we'll go for this p tag for padding set this okay now let's go to here and we'll set this font width for this item also so now we'll go for this p tag so this is description tag for ours and now we'll copy and paste this all items and now we'll change this p tag here and we will set this padding for this 10 pixel and this will set this font size and font weight also and this the letter spacing also will set this and now you can see like this so now it's going to text transform so we will remove this and now you can see the text is cap a small letter and one is capital letter on the starting after adding this now we will set this font size sorry padding size we will set this this left and right so it will be 15 pixel so after adding this this text is looking like that so after adding this is completed like this so now we'll go for this 
icon button for will add a play icon set this after this card here we'll type this card icon button plus here so we are here we are going to using the font awesome cdn that is latest version is you can search it on google directly and you will find this font awesome cdn the latest version and here we are using this icon is play icon you can get this on the font awesome.com and i am adding this and this so i am making that that video will be faster so that's why i copy and paste this everything here and now we'll set this for this style for this icon class and I will set this position as absolute because we want to make this big background class I want to remove it from this font icon here so we'll set top left and here we'll set this font size that is 10 rem and after adding this so now we'll copy this fast this class name this is common class and we'll set class here and now we'll set this for the background color so here I'm going to set this background so we'll copy this color here and enter this color here so first of all we'll set the background is and this color will set this the same color as we chose it and now we'll up increase the opacity for this and now we'll set this border radius that is will be 50 pixel and it will be circle border you can see like this so now you can see like this it's almost done here so now we'll add this for this animation property for this item for this go to this animation that is icon here and now we'll be add animation bounce animation that is bounce here i have this added this title property and now we'll set this for this item here and now we'll open this keyframe here and this keyframe is bounce and here we will add this for this 10 pixel 10 percent so here when it is 10 percent and it will be the transform scale will be 0 0.3 so now we'll copy and paste this all item and now we'll change this value for this 100 percent and it will be 1.2 gram this 1.2 and now here we'll add a transition so that it's go to a smoothly transition here now you can see like this it's hovering this play icon here like this and now we'll make this hover effect for this left side of this title and description and now we'll set this color for this that will be matured color so let's change this color matured for this item here now copy and paste here and i will decrease the opacity for this item also so it's going some more so now we'll decrease some more opacity here let's decrease that and we'll send this set this color for this item also as a massive color that's looking good here like this so we have said that now it's almost done here so now we'll go to this card and we'll go to hover effect so let's add this card hover when you hover this card it will be open this that for this we'll set this content so for this here we'll add a transition so transform translate that is minus 100 percent and it will be the x direction so that will be it will be x direction so it will go to this for this 100 percent minus 10 this left side and we will make it the one over it it will be the transform will be translate x is zero so it will be go to this the back item for this the previous item here this previous position and i will say this transition now you can see like this when you over one it it will be go for this smooth transition from left to right left to right you can see like this so it's successfully done so if you enjoy this video thank you so much for watching this video